Recording now. <laughs> okay, also, this is the art we made. Imscription! Imscription! Press play! Yeah. Alright. Imscription. Funny game. Daniel Mullins. Devolver. Digital. Okay! Time to figure out what's on this thing. Nice! I love the aesthetics, dude. Um, so... Oh yeah, these are like cards for the option menu. <laughs> yeah, and then the only thing I wanted to mention about this menu screen is that you can't click new game. And that's kind of sus. Anyway, let's hit continue. Oh, that is pretty sus. Oh, right. Very sus. <laughs> sus, right? It is. The eyes. I feel like I saw this in a trailer or something. This is part of the trailer, yeah. Another um, challenger. It has been ages. Perhaps you have forgotten how this game is played. Allow me to remind you. Play the squirrel card. Um, so you can like scroll, like I'm just doing a scroll wheel, or you can press like W and S to like go through these. But yeah. Now play your stoat. Stoats cost one blood. Sacrifices must be made. The card is shaking. <laughs> yeah. An honorable death. Play the stoat. Wolves require two sacrifices. You don't have enough. Ring the bell to end your turn and commence combat. I love that everything is shaking. <laughs> I, I think it kind of like shakes when it's like, do this, sort of. But it's also kind of freaky. It's scared. Your stoke <laughs> stands unopposed. The number on the bottom left is its attack power, one. It's felt like a claw and like scraping, which I never noticed until like near the end of the game. But I'm like, oh, it's like a damage. It's like scraping claw. My goodness. Your stoat dealt me one damage. I added it to the scale. You win if you tip my side all the way down. Like this. My turn. Your stoat stands in the way of my coyote. My coyote dealt two damage to your stoat. That means your stoat's health is two less. If a creature's health reaches zero, it dies. It's your turn again. You may draw from your deck, or you may draw a squirrel. I will draw a squirrel. How dull. <laughs> Fucked up. I was I would have drawn from the deck. I would like to be adventurous. <laughs> I'll I'll let you guys play the next level, but because you know. The wolf demands two sacrifices. Fear not, the beast is sacrificed, but not removed from your deck. So I noticed it was talking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a, uh, huh? Stop, wait, or something like that. It goes by really fast. It was like, huh? Hey! Yeah. Its suffering was real, but you will see it again. Because you are learning, I will pass. Again, the choice. A random card from your deck, or the certainty of a squirrel. Deck. <laughs> so we got the river snapper. And also our, our uh, deck is now empty, and so we only have squirrels left. Three damage dealt, three weights on the scale. Pass.
you've won this match. They won't all be so easy. Let me recall your story. Oh, yes. You were lost deep in the forest. A single path revealed itself. Two denizens of the forest approached you tentatively. The Caustic Adder. Damage from his poison bite is always lethal. The Undying Cat. Sacrificing the poor beast does not kill it. Only one may grace your paltry deck. What do you guys want? Well, I like cats, but I don't want to kill the cat over and over. <laughs> I also don't want to kill the cat. <laughs> so maybe like the cats. Maybe the adder, so we don't have to kill the cat over and over. Yeah. <laughs> you guys, you can't be softies for this game. No, yes. I'm a softie. You can't be softies. Adder is cool. It'll still kill. Adder is cool. It'll kill. Another creature joins your caravan. Some of the creatures of the forest seemed willing to follow you. You came across an abandoned sack. You found a squirrel in a bottle, break in case of emergency, and have a second. Another useful implement. I'll allow you to tip the scales with it. The three is as much as you can carry. All right. You were ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. You sacrificed me while I was sleeping. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe you'll help me? Play along for now. You may now see my moves ahead of time. Okay, um, I'm going to give control. Who wants to uh, play this one? I'll try. Play along for now. Wolf Cub is what they're going to play next, I guess? I this, like, it's flashing a right click. What happens if you click on that? Behold, the rule book. Fledgling. A card bearing the sigil will grow into a more powerful form after one turn on the board. Okay. So you can, like, Wherever, like, the right-click flashes, it'll let you, like, click and, like, get info on it. Alright, okay, I gotta think. So this guy is just an obstacle, I guess, that has yeah, health. Like part of the map, basically. Um, the stumps are the same thing. I guess the end goal is to hit him. So should I put something here, or... I don't know. Makes sense. Um, also need something that doesn't require a sacrifice, or I guess I need to put a squirrel down? Yeah, squirrels, squirrels are... you don't need to use any sacrifices to put a squirrel down. But they also don't do any damage. If I put a squirrel down, can I sacrifice it in the same turn, or do I have to wait until yeah. next turn? Yeah, you can immediately uh, sacrifice it. Oh wait, do I need to put it in the other... oh well, it's too late now. Okay, so scroll to... so click... And you can put it wherever. Here we go. Okay, I guess I ring the bell now, because I've done oh like it can't draw any more cards, right? You okay. Draw a card on your first turn. Mind the ambitious wolf cub, it ages swiftly. I guess I'll just get a squirrel. For now. Okay. Um, so there's going to be a bat. I think my stoat will win against the bat because this one does two damage and I have three health, but it has two. Yeah. I think? I think it'll be fine. Yeah. I believe you are correct. Can I place. Okay, so if I wait, can I get another scroll on my next turn? And then yeah. sacrifice two to do one of yeah. these guys. Okay, then I don't think I want to put anything down right now. Alright. 
I want to try to get what I'm thinking is that because the adder can kill anything, mm-hmm. I could put it even if the wolf cub eventually like destroys the boulder, I could put the adder there and kill the wolf cub. <laughs> That's that what it sounds sense. okay. The airborne bat flies over creatures to attack directly. Ha! My bat flew right over your stoat. You wanted a squirrel. Though... You're free to ring the bell if you want to. No, 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 no. Well... Okay, so... Hmm... What'll happen here is you'll ring the bell, the stilt will kill the bat, uh, the wolf will kill the boulder, and nothing else will happen. Okay, I think that's what I want to happen. Might as well get another squirrel, I guess. Adder, so... I think that's good for now. (laughs) A serpent perhaps more deadly than man. Um, what does my river snapper do? I guess it just has a lot of health as the main thing. Yeah. Should I get a new card or should I get another squirrel? I don't know. You were really guess... excited about the deck before, but now well... you're like squirrel all the way. <laughs> but he didn't play any more cards. Okay. Yeah, he might be out for this uh, battle. Um, Okay, so cool, I could put a wolf down. I think I'd rather do a wolf than the river snapper. Is he like moving his eyebrows? Or is it just the card wiggling? Okay. (laughs) (laughs) Nice. You prevailed and trekked onwards past the now bloodied terrain. The young wolf cub. It grows into a wolf after a single turn. The meek sparrow. An inexpensive, if feeble, flying creature. Oh yeah, so this is a flyer. We just learned about flyers. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Like they, He just showed us the two um, that he's kind of offering us now. Though the yeah. sparrow is a little different than the bat. What do you think, Alana? I'm not sure. I mean... Having a flying thing sounds cool, but it's not very strong. It is, like, the sigil is nice, right? Because you don't have to worry about, like, defensive cards. You can just fly over them. That's true. Um, Yeah. The the one thing that's stronger is also nice, because you can actually put it down for a low cost, and then it gets strong later on. That's so it's true. Then it'll become a two cost card, but you only had one sacrifice, if that makes sense. So, either one's good. I guess I'll go with the sparrow, I think. If no one else is going to give an opinion. You stumbled into some strange stones in the mist. You were compelled to choose a worthy sacrifice, one that will be lost forever. What? But we just got that card. (laughs) I think I'd rather get rid of the sparrow than the adder. Okay. I feel like the adder is very useful. Bro, so mean. So fucked up. (laughs) We just got. Oh my god, Stokes is. Yeah. Okay. Ian selected a healthy host, and Stoat says, "Pick me." Okay, Stoat. I don't have no idea whether to trust, but I will. <laughs> it's my instinct to trust. What an honor! A ghastly spectacle, but the soul of the sparrow now lives in the Stoat. Now we got a flying Stoat. That's honestly cute, though. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine a little still with wings. Aww. 
And if you memorize what those icons are, you'll always know, like, okay, so that's a, a sacrifice then, right? Behold my totem. It inscribes my canine cards with the airborne sigil. He's completely, completely insane. Oh, yeah, you see that, right? No care for the rules. Pathetic, really. Enough. Only keeps me around to watch me suffer. Huh. Okay. Um, did, did you want to play another or have Valana play or what are you? Yeah, someone else, someone else can play. You no, know, I'd rather watch just Jenna play. Well, you might enjoy just trying once. I'm gonna force you to. No, I don't. I don't. I don't know what to do. Okay, so scroll, can, scroll to look at the board. Yeah, you can use your scroll wheel, or you can hit W and S. I don't Which care about your dumb problems. items. Everything you have requires at least one sacrifice. Remind you that because we have a stoat, it won't kill the enemies, or we don't have we have a flying stoat, it won't kill the enemies. Like, it's good, but also, if if you put it down, it won't destroy those guys. Uh, it'll just a attack them directly. Yeah, we can only play the stoat. Yeah. Honestly, it's totally fine if you mess up also. Back on the board. Um, so don't even worry about it. I'll just watch ya, too. Okay. My totem has granted my coyote the power of flight. Ow. Or damage to us. I have a feeling we're gonna lose this round. Yeah, me too. I'll and um, the squirrels in a bottle are useful here, so don't be afraid to like use them. Like you, if you want to play your wolf, Wait, for example, you want no? grab your squirrel in a bottle. I would say to the right. Okay. I think, wait, I don't know if you put it in front of the bat, does she die? She has maybe one more hit she can take, but she could do three, she could do four damage if she puts the wolf without the bat, I think, and it would even it out. I think to not die, you have to not put it in front of the bat. I think. Oh, okay. So it'll do four, and then you'll do four, and you'll live. But I think you die after one more hit. Does that make sense? It does make sense. So, Alana, because the, the interesting thing about this game is that it's not a matter of hit points. It's a matter of balancing the scale. So if you do four damage and they do four damage, it's effectively neutralized, right? That's, yeah. So yeah. because if, even though it would be good to get rid of the bat, we'll still take two damage from the coyote. Well, wouldn't that have evened out anyway? The, the coyote would do two damage and... We would do one damage. Oh, okay. No, you're right. Die. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. You're four damage away from winning. I don't know what to do. Can you do it instead? Why don't Why don't we just go for the the die here run? I don't mind. No. Show us Show us your epicest cringe, Alana. Can I do anything? No. Right? That's it. One more squirrel on a bottle, which is the only other thing you can do. Uh, I don't know if we can win this one. How many squirrels? Um, we can play the river snapper. Yeah, put it, put the, put the river snapper in front of the bat, and then we'll the kill bat. the bat. Yeah. I guess a squirrel, right? So this will do three damage. And then I'm doing more damage, so I could just theoretically win. We have our adder, but it's too caught. Um, you could do, you could kill your river snapper because it only does one yeah, damage. Do the same, but this one will kill the wolf. Yeah. Oops, I needed to put the scroll down first. Yeah. Adder. Mm -hmm. And that evens out. Uh, squirrel.
Oh my god, you're so fast. It's just very Whoa. slow. Yeah. I think, well, it's just I think a, we can just win by hitting the bell. Yeah. We're doing like five damage. And then we're receiving two damage, so. Oh. Impressive. You may yet survive this ordeal. Knock on wood. Knock, knock. <laughs> it's a wooden table, right? 